What are we up to now? He's got balls carved into his face. He's rocking a cute haircut. We're in a new place. There's some guy in the background. I kind of miss the woman who sings to me in the barn. So I couldn't sleep last night because there was a sound at four in the morning of, you know, when you get to the bottom of a bowl of soup, it's happened a few nights in a row where you scrape the spoon at the bottom of the soup bowl. And it, it's, it's literally, that's what I'm hearing. And I'm trying to figure out like who or what is making the sound. Mm. Oh, it's like he's late to work. He's panicking. Can I t tell you about my most embarrassing esports moment I've ever had? Um, I was on like an e. Don't ask fucking why, <laughs> but I was on a stage <laughs> at PAX. It's like esports stage, and I was teamed up with like I don't know what esports team. I don't know. It was a guy who was really good at esports, um, and we were. We were doing a we were doing a playthrough of Untitled Goose Game. And there's all these people sitting down watching us, um, and they only gave us one controller for both of us. And um, you know, obviously, as an esports, bang, 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 bang. It's very different to like talking to a camera. So I was like, okay, I'll be the talk. <laughs> Um, but my fucking dumb ass, I skipped the tutorial like I do in every fucking game. I will literally just, I would space bar through. And I decided in front of like a massive audience to just space bar through how to do the controls in Untitled uh, Goose Game. So literally we were just on stage fumbling and not knowing what the fuck to do because... I so every time I see a goose, I'm like, oh, that's that time I was a silly goose on stage when I really should have paid attention. <laughs> I just, I just really just want to go out in the night and sniff the air right now. No, it's literally 2.50 p.m. But like this game just makes me want to sniff. I want to, I want to feel a breeze on my face. I want to touch some grass. I want to live. I want to, I don't want to live where he lives, but it's very beautiful. I just love giving the air a sniff. <gasps> so, no one else dares face me? Is there truly no warrior in all Skellige who can defeat me? Is mad. Shouldn't have killed him. Sam, can you hear me? I hear you. It's still <laughs> lost me tooth. <laughs> How good are cats when they sniff? They do that kind of little. I think the best things are when cats sniff. I've not seen you here before. What do they call you? Geralt of Rivia. I'm Yuta Undimon. No man's been found who could best me in combat. Will you fight me? You? I've defeated Pharaoh's most famous warriors. Men so worthy of respect I don't dare mention their names. And who is Geralt of Rivia? Someone you haven't defeated. Maybe you're not worthy of my time? You performed any great feats? Cause I don't believe I've heard. What kind of feats you have in mind? Hmm. I'll fight you if you defeat Gundar. Couldn't best me, but he's a brave man and a worthy opponent. Good. I'll give it a shot. See you soon. I truly wonder if you will. Farewell. Yeah, so I don't play Gwens. I like to do the horse racing mini quests in the fisticuffs. Fist of Fury defeat. Uh, okay, we're going this way. Oh. Ooh. Accept the challenge. Swing an axe. Come on. Don't be All right, here we go. We're going to fisty calf. I know. In the ring with the real sorceress. Looking for more challengers. Welcome to our tournament, Witcher. I don't think it's very I fair if I get into the ring point. wearing that. Do you wish to fear some? Look what he's wearing. We're wearing like full on fucking. Let's not keep on our waiting. I was surprised by how much I loved it. Fight. I also, I think it's also a me problem where I. Oh! Now that's a decoration. Respectfully? Man. 
pathetic. So this is why I, this is why uh, this is why I stopped playing Valor's Gate. I wrote a blog post a while ago about why I fucking hate video games. Because this is what it does. It appeals to like the male fantasy. Women fantasy. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Oh, left, right. Good night. See you fucking later, cunt. Oh, good night. Beautiful fight. Congratulations on your victory. You've more fights ahead of you. First, you must defeat Grim from Helmstein and Ard's Grim. And Valgard from near Ketrolda. Okay, I can do that. You and the sorceress both. I love Skillage. Like fucking hell! Like, I did. I just turned to the left and like, look at this. This could be a freaking wallpaper. Gorgeous. Hang on, there's a quest. Swords on his back. What do they think of next? Nothing here for Every you. Every man on the continent so bloodless. What's the matter? Maybe trolled on me, brothers. Mikael and Earth sailed to Hindusfjall to fetch Agda, wedding Zin but a few days, but they've yet to return. Mm. A storm broke while they were gone. I fear it might have blown them onto the rocks at Pharaoh. Many have lost their lives there. I'll sail out to find them. I would. But I've got to make sure the wedding's proper prepared. They say it's not fitting for a Skelliger to ask for aid, but I've no choice. Will you help me? Will you seek out my kin? Great voice. Fine, I'll look around for them. The price of honor, let's do it. I don't know if I can deal with that. It looks like I do have to deal with that. How do I get off my horse? Literally don't know how to get off my horse. Sorry, I'm trying to touch my horse. Oh, it's fine. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. I've always been fine. I'm, I'm fucking thriving. Ah, there you are. Don't know about your ways, but here, when you agree to do business, we don't keep focus. What business? Oh, drop the secret shake. We've not the time. Nilfgaardian bloke, uh, really, said he'd send a body for the goods today. So when you go, and just be sure to behave. Huh? I'm not who you think I am. I look like a Nilf guardian to you. What the fuck's your problem? Get in there. You want to crack? Do it with the boss. <sighs> Take me to the boss. Fine, I'm going. What's your solution, is it? She's trolling. No, she's she's neuro spicy. She's she's just her. She's just unfiltered and has like safe face. For me. She's not trolling. No, this is her. <laughs> Had to calm a few of them, but we managed it without doing serious harm. Tough islanders, these. They'll serve you well. Good. Vile doesn't like cock-ups. Hmm. Sure it was Vile who sent you. Expected someone more... Nilf Guardian. Yeah, well, I don't even want to be here. Sorry to disappoint. To be honest, I'm not from Nilfgaard. And I haven't the faintest who Vile is. Enemy in the camp! To arms! Fuck! Back off! I'll kill him! Very impressive that, that is so good. Yeah, damn right. I can drink and fight at the same time. My cup of tea. Oh! Hang on. I didn't mean that. I'm sorry. I'm not whistling at you. It's very rude. Oh, God. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. Pirates everywhere. Watch out. Come here. <laughs> okay, I'm going to deal with this guy. He's annoying me. Oh, my God. Shit. He's stuck. I don't know how to get him. Watch this. <laughs> hey, 
Why is it doing that? Why is it farting? Oh yeah, okay, I'm using farts and oh okay, well that's doing nothing. Smell a card. Well this isn't fucking embarrassing. Oh. Fuck! Okay. God, it really means. No, no, don't light a match here. Don't fucking light a match. Don't. Don't. We will die. Don't you dare. No, that's not a good idea. That's not a good idea. No. I died really badly. Thank you, best. Any last words? Chicken! Yeah, I don't know what all that was about back there. Just killed. I think they were pirates or something. Something terrible. The price of honor. It's not looking good, besties. Oh, that's a nice Christmas tree. Look at that. Someone's got some rocks around it. That's nice. Oh, I think it's drowners. Yeah. Oh, sirens. <laughs> Oh, okay, they're right there. Um. Blue and bloated. Didn't seem to bother the sirens, though. Must have nabbed her body soon after she drowned. Kira's mm. lamp ought to prove really handy here. Oh, I haven't been able to use this lamp until now. Since that quest with the Spongy Ghost. Merciful Freya, forgive your son. Meant to escort our brother's patrol to her wedding, a storm beset us and bested us. All is lost. Agdalai's dead. Her dowry drowned. Tis a taint on the clan's honor. Forgive us, O oh Freya, most noble. Stop, Miguel. Freya can't wash our shame away. Only blood can. Let's do it as it must be done. There, neath the tree. We'll pray. And then, end it. Aye, you're right. Be better that way. <laughs> what do they mean? By that? It's fucking horrible. Go, 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 go. Oh, the prince. Wonder where they lead. can hear crows. Ah, oh, okay, yeah. Skelligan Honor chose to die instead of living with the knowledge that led down their brother. Now their brother's got double loss. It's even more painful. Freya's symbol, scrawled in blood. <gasps> Brothers entrusted themselves to the goddess before they died. Oh, a chest key. Letter from Agda's father. Timon of Clean Dimon. I'm delighted. I am delighted my Agda will wed as virile a warrior as yourself. Pride fills my heart to think your marriage will unite our two families. I trust you will forgive my absence. But with my many years and many more injuries, travel is no longer possible. I thank you for sending your brothers to escort Agda. My own lads are all drinking mead with our ancestors, so if not for Alf and Mikael, Agda would have no worthy company on her journey to a wedding ceremony. Start you on your path together properly. I will entrust Agda's dowry to your brothers. On behalf of myself and all of our clan, I also convey to you both my sincerest blessings. 
Respect each other and live in harmony. May you thrive and prosper. Jorgen of Clan Heime. Mm, so the dad doesn't. Oh, there's the. There's the ship. The dad doesn't know. I wonder if the key is. The chest is on the boat. I mean, free real estate is free estate is terrible, but like, you know, I don't need it. I might not need it. How do I how, get rid of this? Hang up. Scary. Down again. Maybe it's not. Oh, there it is. Dowry. What's in her dowry? Gold diamond necklace. Oh, yeah. Hello. How are you? I am under the water. Please help me. You're too much raining. Hang on. I think someone's still down there. We've got to help. Someone's down there. Look at this. It's pastel. Geralt isn't the most charismatic gentleman I know. Can be quite deadpan, which can be quite funny. But sometimes he breaks the news really badly. Like we've had to tell a lot of people that their loved ones have passed. And I don't think we've uh, done it appropriately ever. But it's all right. It's all right. We're, we're a witcher. We're not a, I don't know, social worker. That Lion King? Sever his head. What? Head of a giant on your mantle. No, that's a decoration. Make you fucking pardon? Whose head? Did you sever his head? Hoons. <laughs> Maybe. Oh god, here we go. Got some bad news. Sadly, Agda's dead. So are your brothers. Uh, what? Huh? What are you saying? A storm destroyed their boat. Agda was killed. Your brothers felt they'd let you down. Couldn't live with the shame. They chose death. Found this letter. Might help you come to terms. A letter? That's all that's left. There's also a key and a necklace. Okay, found her chest with the dowry, yeah. I just we lied. <laughs> Nothing else. I, I literally I could not. Also found your fiance's dowry. Small comfort, but still. Thanks. Few men would be so honorable. Fare ye well. Yeah, so whenever we break the news to NPCs that someone or so someone's dead, I really like that they cry and they don't just go back to work. <laughs> Some like this, sorry, this is awful to say, but like sometimes they'll yeah they'll just like go off to the docks and just cry and scream into the ocean, which makes sense. Like it would be really weird if yeah you told him his entire family's dead and then he just goes back to. I mean I guess everyone coached that differently, but like. <laughs> I mean, yeah, maybe like beating a fucking sword with a hammer could work, but yeah, I do like how they cry. I like that they cry. I like that grown men cry. I think it's important to cry. Okay, we're gonna give him another fisty fight. What the fuck was that? I feel like I'm playing Skyrim. You're just like in a village and in a friggin'. Dragon appears? Ha, All right, let's go. Greetings. You know me? Aye, I've heard of you. Don't recall exactly why, but I'm sure it was unsavory. <laughs> heard you, uh, Thanks. fights here. You heard right. Try your luck if you like. I'm ready. Fight mercilessly. But do it with honor. Welcome back. 
Fuck, he's quite tanky, isn't he? Facing the wrong way. Shit. Oh, good. Come on. I think I can only. Oh, wait. That's not fair. I got another life. This is so unfair. And I'm stuck. I'm literally fucking stuck. How do I block? That's so unfair. I mean, that's great. That's funny. But also, like, that's kind of unfair. I got another life? <laughs> I'm stuck on a bush. I'm stuck. <laughs> I get three lives. I fight for crowns. Come in, JW. Freya, damn it. That was Odysseus Valgard, a worthy opponent. I was spoon fed. A win's a win. Decent folk live here. That's not right. <laughs> I have to kill Valgard, uh, not kill, I have to fight Valgard now. No such thing as bad ships or bad weather. Only worthless fucking sailors. I don't know, if it's got a fucking hole in it, I think it's pretty bad. We were don't eat so much. Why the spit not? Because if you get hit in the gut and those herrings get tangled in your entrails, you'll be... I want to fight. Grand. Tell me Look at these tatters! Ready to fight right now. Done well so far. Hope your luck continues against Olaf. Like Where's our fart? Some words with the outlander oh my god, he looks fucking terrifying. He's got ladders for tatters! It's about my Erica. See her? I... I gotta win today. She's watching. I don't stand a chance against you. I know it well. Oh, you're gonna keep But I was thinking, hands. maybe you'd let me win. We're gonna play snakes and ladders and connect the dots. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I genuinely don't think I'll be able to beat him. But I think it'd be kind of funny if we beat him. Maybe he's a shit. We're gonna fight him for, for glory. I'm not about to throw a fight. Listen, if I lose on purpose, we'll both regret it. Believe me. But it's Erica we're talking about. Erica! You don't understand a thing. Enough of this chatter. Fight! Okay, I think I'm gonna lose. Valgard. Oh, get out of the way, chicken! Oh, he's a lower level. Oh no, the chicken died! The chicken died! That's so sad! Oh! Oh, that's fucking devastating news. Okay, so he's not as good as the other guy. Someone's murdered a chicken. Don't know if it was me or him. Very well could have been me. I think the guy is carrying the box behind us. Fuck. I think I might lose. <laughs> There's a child laughing at me. Fuck. The 
Anders won! Oh, she's so Erica impressed. Wins. Let her go. The Outlander's proven himself worthy of facing Olaf. Your opponent, Skellig's champion, awaits on on Skellig. What do witchers do once there are no basilisks, lesions, or giants around? Eh? I recognize your type a mile away. What does that mean? Need help? I'd like it here. Need help? I'd like it here. Like it here. Need help? Good like advice. Oh, I don't want to alarm you, but there is a three-headed horse behind you. Collateral damage, the chicken. Yeah, very sad. That's cute. This is a vibe. This is nice. Is this favorite chicken? Ah. Uh. I don't know if this is my stuff or whose stuff. Why my stuff is in what? What's this? Her megascope. Guess she never goes anywhere without it. Am I in? As Philip Wait, where's it? Wait, said, megascopes and toothbrushes. What? Deeply personal possessions. Oh, oh we're in Unifer's house. <laughs> but where's the unicorn? Did we break the unicorn? Maybe. Yeah, there used to be a unicorn here. I thought it was that other guy's house. Oh, okay. We're off to fight Olaf. I wonder if I let him win, if then it would end. And that's it. Oh, look at them in the sleeves. Oh, he's cozy. Oh, I like that. Yeah, that's a bit of me. Yeah, you get your phone, you get your snacks, you get your blanket, you get your TV. You want some shit. Oh, yeah. What is it? Can I join? Can here. I be friends with you? There's no point standing here in the rain. All right, let's go to mine. We'll talk there. You got snacks. So what's the matter? You see that knoll beyond the village? Weren't a thing there for centuries. Till one day we awoke, bam. There were oh, towers. Sorceress. Maybe. And all of a sudden lightning started pounding down. As if the Noggle Fair itself was sailing in. Hasn't stopped to this day. Something's gotta be done. About the storm. With waves like that, we can't fish nor sail out to raid. You tried getting inside the tower? Have we tried? Very same morning the tower appeared. We went right off. Whole village or near boats. Folk wanted to welcome its owner if he came in peace. Drive him off if he came with ill intent. We knocked and banged, but no one answered. So we opened the door. That's when our knees turned to jelly. Why? Because beyond that door was something like a sheet of water, but standing upright. Never seen such a thing in my life. Well, Druid said it were magic. Gathered five brave lads and they all marched in. No sign of them since. I'll look into it. Fine. I'll look into the tower. Once you're in, cast your eye around for the folk from our village. Our druid and five good lads. Oh, I'd be a bitter shame to lose them. You have my word. Hemdel, guide you. Let's do this quest. Enter the tower. I feel like it could be a sorcerer. Sorceress it's in the books. Wow. Oh, that's great. Best kind of weather. Oh, plucking some chickens in the rain. Everyone's still working. Could not be me. Oh my gosh. That goat's got somewhere to go. They go up everywhere overnight. I 
sure if I've heard this song before. I feel like in the game they hate all wizards. Witches, wizards, magicians. Scared of the unknown, maybe. I mean, they don't even have like a working stove. Maybe they're just like, whoa, this person's got fire coming out of their hands. That's fucked. I don't know. This is cool. They're jealous. Yeah. They will never be her. It comes out of their bums. Stairs first. <laughs> it's a little bit treacherous. I can't go upstairs. I've got to go downstairs. A portal. Shit. Oh, he hates portals. Did you know? Great. Portal closed. Hmm. Looked smaller from the outside. Intruder detected. Cease your intrusion. Leave at once. Fuck. Failure to leave when summoned. I've got to save. I've got to save. Come on, come closer. Oh gosh. Okay, I really don't like golems. Is this slow? Oopsies. Oh, my plate's broken. I just realized. Oopsies. <laughs> Sounds like Chewbacca. I can't sound like Chewbacca. <laughs> I'm gonna steal all your shit. No, I got. I just trying to distract me from treasure. They won't work. Golem probably greeted them too. Yeah, no. Nah, hang on, I've got stuff to do. Bread. I wonder how long that's been then. Penny, hello. Good to have you. Welcome in. Okay, now that I've taken all this stuff. I'm in here. Finally, someone's come to free me. And a famous witcher at that. I don't trust him. Gods. I'm damned lucky you happen to be in Korea. Are you dressed like a newspaper? King Tancred who sent you, or the Society of Magic? Neither, and we're not in Kavir. We're in Skellige. Local folk hired me. See, your towers brought a massive storm to their island. We're in... 
in Skellige. So we've teleported. Oh, this is much worse than I thought. Let me guess. You lost control of the golem. Imprisoned you here, then attacked me. My, no, that's not it at all. The golems are but one of the tower's defenses. Part of its defensive regulatory magicon. What? A defensive system. Magic. Ensuring only the tower's owner will use it. When it detects an intruder, it locks down all the ones denied. Wait, so he locked himself in. Since neither of us is the tower's owner, the golem attacked me, <laughs> and you're stuck behind bars. How do we evade its other charming features? We must deactivate the defensive regulatory magic on. The tower's prior owner wrote a treatise about removing such defenses. Gottfried's omni-opening grimoire. Oh yeah. There must be a copy in the tower. Find it, please. With it in hand, I can try to circumvent the security measures. Send you home and take the tower back to Kavir. You clearly know who I am. I don't even know your name. Seagull Bunce. Mage and sorcerer in residence at the court of Companis. This tower was to be my new home. Bought it at an auction, you see. <laughs> A tower at an auction? <laughs> it belonged to Gottfried Stamfeld, a mage of some renown. When he passed on, his heirs all... That's how it works. Off. They were all wary, repulsed. None dared see what Uncle Gottfried kept in his coloured jars. I thought they just made them. their contents that had stripped him of his sense of smell and taken his left eye. They put the tower on the block, along with all it contained. The price was unbeatable. Something's wrong with it then. If it's an unbeatable price, it's probably got water damage. Water damage, rats, something, maybe it's haunted. Yeah, I didn't think that magicians would just buy, they'd just buy towers like we buy houses. I thought they would and make them you know, the, the power that they have not you know bricks and mortar and they just be like wow wow what did you that did you boom boom body did it yeah right there's probably some black mold i think you got a lemon the corpse is over there folk from the village nearby right they came in a few days past i was surprised to see their garb but it just never entered my mind we might be in Skelliger. There were just a few. Oh, well, that's all right it. then. <laughs> the tower warned them. They failed to heed. Folk on On Skellig usually laugh in the face of warnings. If the tower had asked nicely, then offered them a horn of mead, they might have left then. Seen my share of wonders, but a tower that teleports itself? That's something new. This defensive regulatory magicon. I tried to access it. Must have heard. Initiated some evacuation sequence. That opened He tried to get a smart house and he got a scalable. fart house. This, in turn, naturally generated electromagnetic disturbances. Hence the storm. Storm I promised to dispel. Then you must find Gottfried's omni opening grimoire. <laughs> right. Time to get out of here and send this tower home. What do I look for Gottfried's treaties? Any ideas? Hmm, the library might be a logical place to start. The key should be in the laboratory. Where's the that? Laboratory. As you enter the room opposite, you'll see the laboratory to your left. The library straight ahead. But remember, you're an intruder. The tower is certain to want to stop you. Make things difficult at the least. We'll see who breaks first. Why <laughs> should she do that? Uh, I have a feeling there's gonna be a great quest. What? I didn't have a fine day too. Ooh. Find the key to the library using your witcher senses. It's down here. Intruder in tower. Aqueous countermeasures in effect. Oh my god, this is like a fucking electric hill. This is fucking all- I'm gonna get fucking scared. Oh, yes! A half a car on Wheel of Fortune. We 
We won a lot of half cars, eh? That's a great game. Oh, God! You're in a bit of a pickle. It's good to have you all. Chat, go follow my friend Del. Whoa, oh my gosh. Oh, that's cute. Oh, no, never mind. No, but it's still kind of cute. So I have this idea. Wet the clay, just a sliver of clay, and then, um, oh my god, it doesn't end. Fuck, he's fast. Fuck. Okay, is that it? Please be it. Please, please, please. I don't think I... There's more? A cow? <laughs> is it gonna blow up? I don't trust it. No. It's gonna blow up. It's a fucking grenade. Get the fuck out. Everyone get out. Get out. Get out. That's funny. This is a whack-ass library. Oh, key to library. Oh, the key to the library. My bad. Okay. Tristan's a doshi out of tales of fantasy and wonder. When a traveler from the northern realms first crosses the border into Tucson, he feels at once as though he has stepped onto a land ripped straight from the pages of fantastic fairy tale. Ooh. He will know no inclement weather there, and even the winters of Tucson are mild and sunny, with only gentle calming breezes and not a hint of a gale. He will know no hunger, for the trees and the bushes of that land burst with ripe and juicy fruits all year long. He will know no loneliness, for each and every soul he encounters will treat him like a long-lost friend. He will know not a single backwater of dullness, boredom, or inquietude in this overflowing stream of marvel. In Toussaint, the wine rages in torrents. Music plays ceaselessly, and everywhere the air is filled with the sound of birdsong and the twittering of beautiful maids. We were never stingy with their ample charms when a handsome knight comes a-calling. The capital of the duchy, Beauclair, is an architectural gem, full of glorious elven monuments, delicately. This sounds like propaganda to get people to move to Tucson. It's not real. No. No, they're just trying to get people to move there. No, it's a shit hole, isn't it? <laughs> no, Tucson hasn't even got a fucking croissant. All right, let's enter the library. Which is not here. Hopefully no more boss, oh not boss fights, that wasn't really a boss fight. Hopefully no more fighting. My arm is broken. It's not ideal. This is the library. Who's who among Kaviri sorcerers? Alchemy for Household Dilemmas, Volume 3. This isn't it. Not to backseat your library, but why would you have the entrance full of water? Oh, here it is. Gottfried's Omni opening grimoire. This is it. <laughs> The defensive regular Magicon, or DRM for short, belongs to the above-mentioned group the longest-lasting, most effective, and hardest to break defensive mechanisms. In order to recognize the individual administering it, it makes use of a portal mounted at the entrance of the arrow it is to defend. This portal passes streams of magic energy through the body of the person entering and can, in the blink of eye, determine if this person has the corporal signature, eyeball structure included. <laughs> of the entitled administra, administrator. As a result, the only, un the only unauthorized individuals that could possibly hope to enter are mimics. Wait, is this what happens? Maybe the guy is a mimic? Maybe the previous owner is not dead? DRM thus makes for an extremely effective and near unbreakable security measure, but if you are in luck, you've just told us how to fucking beat it. For you hold in your hands the key to bypassing it, namely the present tome, Godfian's Omni Opening Grimoire. Did this guy pay for this house? <laughs> Damn, Looks like he's up to gas me. Horrible way to die.
Bring the mage Gottfried Omni opening grammar. I wanted to explore the library more. Collection integrity compromised. I guess there's nothing else there. It's telling me to go. I've got words to have with you, young man. I think you're up to something. Find the tool. I think he's done something dodgy. This it. It is indeed. Now back away a bit. I must deactivate the barrier. What are you, Ibrahim Adfidjat? Isolation chamber open. Isolation chamber. Disturbing indications. This is open. feeling very like sci-fi. There, alas. I don't trust him. Not easy. The hardest part is yet to come. We must reach the heart of the tower and cast a deactivating spell. The tower will surely do everything in its power to stop us. Lead the way. We must go to the central chamber. Try to power down the security chamber. measures. The defense. But first, I need to look at all your crap. Try making food. Did you notice the references? Um, no. What's it in reference for? I've already read that one. For someone who's never watched Doctor Who, it feels like Doctor Who. Intruder oh, wow. detected. Encroachment detected. <laughs> Acute threat to control. Encroachment <laughs> He didn't warn me about this? Doing no damage. Acute threat to control. Get out of it. Oopsies. Okay. The tower out of nowhere. Gottfried's treaties proved highly useful. It's over. Had you not arrived, I'd still be in that cage, surely. It's a trifle, but take it, please. Proof of my gratitude. Thanks. I'm just so covered in blood. Satisfied if you calmed that storm and took this tower somewhere else. Consider it done. And should you ever visit Kavir, do stop by Pompvanis. Abaragi. Abaragi, Wait, what are you doing? Oh my god, are we getting transported too? Oh shit. Uh, not this way, the door. <laughs> I got a new sword. Quest updated the tower out of nowhere. How funny. That was a kooky man. Can see from afar, no magpie shit. 
Yes, thank you. Yeah. That's what he says. He sees a guy fall from the clouds. A hot man. A hot man fall from the clouds. And he's not like, wow, does he come from heaven? He goes, oh, yeah, you're definitely not bird shit. Is it it's raining hot man, hallelujah. Oh. You're alive and in one piece. One soaking wet piece. Will you teach me to fly? Another time, maybe. Never seen such marvels in me life. Boom, flash, tower disappeared, and you was fallen from the sky. And the storm, gone in an instant. Now, didn't I tell you? It's what of which we needed. Hey, can't do better than an expert. And expert work deserves a fitting reward. Need. Thanks, but you need that coin a lot more than I do. Not enough that he's handy. He's noble, too. Ringa. She what? likes him. Found a mage in the tower. He was just as eager to take it away from here. Rewarded me generously for my help. If that's so, we've not left but to say our thanks. I will, if you ever come through here again, stop in. You'll be welcomed with open arms. Thanks. She so really well. likes him. She looked at her man and sighed. I wish my man would fall from the sky. I wish my man would get rid of you happen to see me brother in there? Burns his name. He went in with the druid and a few other lads. I found your friends all dead. I found your friends. All dead, unfortunately. Sorry. Told him not to go. But he wanted glory. <laughs> ah. Let's go home, y'all. No point standing here. Farewell, Witcher. Thanks again for helping. This guy's got push-ups today. He he did not even move. He does not care. Let's talk to the lady. Is this her? Now she doesn't want to talk to me. Well, love is fickle. The fish are flying. Yeah, good quest.